There are many quick keys available within Windows. Uh, for this demonstration, we'll just take a look at a few that are available. For example, I'm looking at my desktop right now and I want to open a program without using the mouse. I can use Alt-Tab and that brings up what programs are available and I can see them right here on my screen and as I click tab it'll open up one right after the other. Okay, so now I'm in my page. If I want to go back to my screen I can hit Windows D, the Windows button on my keyboard which is normally to the left of your Alt key but it varies based on which keyboard you're using. If I want to open up my um, start button I can click on Control Escape that'll open it up and then I can use my arrow keys and enter keys as needed to open up different applications and I can also use escape to get me outside of these um, applications. I'll go to my Windows document or my Word document I'll open that up and in here I want to use some quick keys so I clicked end to go to the end of my line and I can click home to go to the beginning of my line. I'll click shift and home and it'll take me right to the beginning. I could use my arrow keys or shift and control and it'll select one full word at a time. I want to copy the first line of this nursery rhyme. So I'll hit control C, use my arrow key, hit enter, move up, control V, paste, and then this is going to be the title. So I want to select it, so I'm going to click shift and home. I want to make it bold. So control V, shift and home again to select it again. I want it to be underlined. I want it to be italicized. So I have all of those done um, without ever actually touching the mouse. This does help things move a lot faster. Okay, so I've got my poem there. Next thing I want to do is go into my spreadsheet. So I can alt tab to my spreadsheet. There it is. I can arrow around and for example if I want to go back to the top of my sheet I can hit control home and that will take me to the top left hand side of my sheet. Uh, we always try to think about security when working with our computers and logging off or locking your computer can take a little bit of time. So one way to deal with that is you can use Windows and L. I can't do that for our example since it will lock me right out of the computer. Um, but that will lock your computer, which will require a username and password for you to log back in, um, which is much more efficient than having to go through the Windows button and then lock. If I want to close something or quit the program, I can hit Alt F4. It'll ask me, do I want to save changes? If I haven't, I'll say no, and it's gone. I can do the same thing again, Alt F4 and it quits the, app, the application. And that is an example of some of the quick keys available within Windows.